Okay, in talking about communication, as you see, I have three pennies here. Three regular pennies. I'm going to be dropping water on them in this eyedropper here, a drop at a time. Now, they're all going to have the same water with the same eyedropper. They're all pennies, so I would assume they'd all hold about the same amount. But let's see. Let's see the things that might affect them. Okay, here we go. So how many drops do you think I can fit on top of a penny? Two, five, 20? What do you think? Let's see. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Got to get more water. Seventeen, eighteen. Wow, look at that. Can you see how it's all bubbled out? Nineteen. 20, 21, 22, oh, okay. So we got 21 that held on that, the 22nd bled right over, right? All right, let's try it on this penny. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, whoops, 15, 16, more water, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, oh, 23, okay. Now let's try our last one. So this one held two more than this one. Did you guess that this one would hold more than that one? Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. More water. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Can you believe it's all still on there? Have you ever felt like that? Like everything was just piled up and one more drop and everything would just fly everywhere? I think it happens to us, doesn't it? 19, 20, look at that. So this one held the least. You wanna hear something funny? This is the oldest and it held more. This is the newest. No, this one's, this one was, was minted the latest, I think. Let's see if I can read that. Yeah, yeah, and yet it held the least. What I'm trying to tell you in all of this, a good object lesson for us is, is that you can't always know by the age or the appearance of someone how much they can deal with things, how much they can hold on top of their penny head. You know, sometimes we all feel like we're just one water drop away from just spilling everywhere. We have to be careful how we communicate with each other. We have to be careful how we approach one another both your colleagues and your residents and residents' family, because we don't know how full their little bubblehead penny is. We walk around with these big, all these issues in one little drop and it goes everywhere. Sometimes someone might explode on you. We don't know what they're dealing with. And you can't always tell by the way it looks. You can't always see what everyone is dealing with, and that's something to keep in mind. Another thing to remember about this, as you saw, they all had the same water, the same dropper, the same size drops that are coming on them. 
but other things can, can affect that. How fast the drop is, how fast the water is coming, from how high we drop it on. Are there any other external circumstances, like is the table being bumped or something like that? There's a lot of other things that go into how people will react to you and how you will react to others and to keep it in check, always to keep that in check.